Hi, this is Lee Ellis with another installment of Leading with Honor Coaching. You know, Kevin recently told me that the most downloaded item on our website is the honor code, which is thrilling to me because in our culture today, we need a lot of emphasis on honor. And those seven items in the honor code are so powerful, so simple, so powerful, so hard to keep up with. I thought I'd talk about one of them this month as we go into the holidays, the season when we're all really busy in COVID anyway. It's much more difficult now, it seems, to keep up with things than it ever has been before. There's so much going on, and now it's going to be even more busy as we get in the holidays. And that item number three in the honor code is keep your commitments, keep your word and your commitments. It's so important to do that, but it's so easy sometimes for many of us to slip on that. So how can we keep up with it? Well, first of all, we have to be intentional. You know, it's so easy to say things that we're going to do when we really haven't thought it through. So let's be intentional when we make a commitment. And then in the moment, let's be more self-aware. Is this really something I want to commit to and I can do? And then surely we'll have to make times when we say, I just can't do that. I cannot promise I can do that. Maybe I can, maybe I can't, but I can't promise. That way we kind of put ourselves on a good footing to start with. But if we do commit, let's write it down. For me, I have to write it down nowadays. There's so much going on around me. And then fail fast. If you can't keep your commitment, call somebody, email them, text them, whatever, and let them know, hey, I said I'd have that done by this Friday. I just can't make it. So much going on, but I will have it for you next week. Or there are certain situations when you have to say, you know, I've thought it through. That's not something I really can do. And I'm just going to have to back out and let you know quickly that I can't make that. Well, that's so much better than dragging it on. So often we put things off out of fear. We accept and take it on out of fear that they won't like us, but then we might put off telling them that we're not going to do it because we don't don't want to look bad. We want their approval, and we're just afraid to own it. But when you take ownership of something that you know you can't do, or you can't do it by a certain date, and you let people know you're actually doing them a favor, and they're going to trust you more next time because they'll know that they can trust you to keep your commitments. And that's what's so important in today's world. It always has been. It's even more important today. So I want to encourage you to live and lead with honor. Download the seven articles, this one page from our website, The Honor Code, and then coach yourself to live by it. I promise you, it will not be easy, but it's so rewarding. You sleep well at night, and it really helps others to trust you more. Well, I hope you have great holidays. God bless, and we'll see you in 2021.